Welcome back to our brand knowledge channel. Various people have asked for this audit checklist for manufacturing and all that. And you can get it from various book. The one which I find it very crisp, short, clear, now that it's from the book called Juron Quality Planning uh, and Analyze for Enterprise Quality, 5th edition. And is an Indian edition and wonderful book. And it's a Migra Hills is a public uh, publications. Right. So uh, in page number 422, it has given 20 checkpoints. I'm going to quickly read it out and uh, you can also take a note from it and it will be useful for you. You can make a make it tailor made content from it. Right. So let's start. The first whenever you're making the audit checklist for the production, this is for men. This is under the chapter called manufacturing set setup uh, sector. Sorry. So is the specification accessible to production staff? Number one. Number two is the current revision on file is on the production. Uh, is the copy of file in a good conditions, no deteriorations, and all pages are accounted for and all that. If the reference document, number four, if the reference document are posted on equipment, do they match the specification? Uh, is the number five, is the log sheet is referred in a specification, in sample included in a specification? Uh, number six, is the operator completing the log sheet according to spec and or lots with the out of specification like non-conformity uh, non-conformity uh, product uh, right or lots with out of specification reading authorized and taken care in writing by the engineering department are the proper supervisor number eight this is a very important point managing the 10.2 uh, non-conformity and all that number uh, eight are correction to paper are made according to spec and has it been approved by engineering department number nine are the equipment time settings according to spec and are the sometimes what happens the the operator feels that you know this is the oven temperature to be kept and all that modifies it and the process continues it and uh, but the document stays uh, some other thing so if the document has to be revised it need to be brought to a discussion and then reviewed with the G uh, team and then uh, and after approval this can be followed right so uh, then the same uh, you know th this also talks about are the equipment temperature setting according to a specification is the calibration sticker on the equipment current uh, is available or not do the chemical or gases listed to a specification match the actual usage do quantities listed in the specification ma match the line setup are the changes of chemical or gases man made according to spec is the production supervisor certified if not the, is the per person authorized by the supervisor is the production operating procedure according to spec if, and is the operator performing return cleaning procedure according to spec and 18 is a very important point if the safety re uh, requirement are listed in the specification and are they followed and uh, look for the evidences look for the demonstrations and all that it, it says and then if the, if the process control procedure return in the specification are the actions performed by the process control verifiable and the lastly it says that if the equipment maintenance procedure are return in the specification are the uh, action performed verifiable according to spec and this has been they have taken the permission from the ASQ wonderful points very short and crisp uh, it also talks about why i like this one it also talks about the risk management the current process and all that i hope you like this video please do like share subscribe my channel you have one